Hello friends, today we are going to hear the story about classic Christmas tales. So today we will hear the third story. Here you go. The story name is First Christmas. Long ago in the town of Nazareth there lived a beautiful and good young woman named Mary who was to be married to a carpenter named Joseph. One day, an angel appeared to Mary. He greeted her and told her not to be afraid and said, You will bear a son and will call him Jesus. He will be the holy child, the son of God. Sometimes after the angel visit, it was decreed by the rulers of the land that everyone had to return to their old town to be taxed and as Joseph came from Bethlehem, he had his wife Mary had to travel there. Joseph and Mary were poor, so Joseph walked while Mary rode their donkey. It was a long journey, and when they arrived in the town, they were tired and indeed of place to sleep. But Bethlehem was so crowded with all the people who had come to be taxed that they couldn't find no place to stay. At last, they stopped at an inn, and Joseph asked if they could stay there for every where else was full and Mary his wife was so tired that she could travel no further I am sorry said the innkeeper but you see the town is full there is no room in the inn is there nowhere we can stay asked Joseph sadly as he held the tired donkey's rein. well said the man they're always the stable I suppose it's not much, but at least it's warm and dry for your wife. Mary smiled her thanks and she and Joseph made their way to the warm stable where the innkeeper's donkey and oxen were quietly marching. Joseph made a comfortable bed for Mary in the hay and straw that lay on the floor and during the night the baby Jesus was born. Mary wrapped him up warmly and laid him in the soft hay up manger. The donkey and the oxen watched as he lay smiling up at his mother Mary. In the field around Bethlehem, there were shepherds watching over their sheep and protecting them from thieves and wild animals. Suddenly, the darkness of night was gone and a bright light shone all around them. An angel appeared in the middle of the light and said to be terrified shepherds, Do not be afraid, for I bring you joy news. Tonight in Bethlehem is born a baby who is Christ the Lord. Glory to the God in the highest and on the earth peace and good will to all the men. Here is the picture where Jesus is born. The frightened shepherd clung together as the angel disappeared and the glorious light faded from the night sky and then one braver than others said let us go down in Bethlehem and see if we can find out what has happened so all the staffers made their way into Bethlehem and found the stable where the baby Jesus lay in the manger with the animals watching him. They found the baby and his mother and bowed down and worshipped him. They left a lamb as a present for him and went back to their field rejoicing. Three wise men from the east who had studied the heavens followed a star for many weeks because they believed it foretold the birth of a king and savior. They went fast to the king Herod for they thought the birth would be at his court but he knew nothing and asked them to return with news of baby when they had found him. They followed the star further until it seemed to be stand still in the sky, right over the stable where the baby Jesus lay. The three wise men went into the humble stable and kneeling before baby Jesus, and his mother gave him gifts of gold and frankincense and myrrh. 
when the wise men left they were warned by god in a dream not to return to tell king herod where the baby jesus was for he wanted to harm him so they returned to their own country by another way joseph was also warned in a dream of the danger so he took mary and his wife and the baby jesus and fled into egypt where the king herod couldn't find them that is the story of first christmas the birth of jesus which happened 2000 years ago and is still celebrated today the end hope you like the story if you like please click the like button and subscribe to our channel thank you bye bye